Good afternoon, one and all present here. My name is Sanjit Reddy. I'm presenting on a speech. I'm presenting about the history of photography. Photography. What do you know about it? It is a way of expressing your world. It's a way that makes you think about what others know about them, about the world. We should be thankful to the, to the father of photography, Joseph Risefor Risefe. He he made photography. He also made camera that helps us take photo. In the year nineteen, in the year eighteen twenty two, he in the town known as Burgundy, France, he made photography a reality. He poly he used the polished paper plate and kept petroleum de- derivative, which was known as bet betium of jerem, which he used to make photos. Because of his great invention, in the 18th, old masters they used to take photos of great things, great personalities, great animals, great places, and showcase it to the world around us. We should be thankful of him for inventing such a beautiful invention. Do you know what's the golden age? Well, in the history of photography, during the 1930s to the 1950s. It was called during the timeline. Photography had a huge name. This was known as the golden age of photojournalism because flash bulbs were at that time more easily available to photographers, which helped them to take photos even more accurately and flexibly, which helped them to gain a lot of name. And photography became very popular during this time. We should be very happy, but. During now, in the uh, mid twenty, we are seeing photos everywhere. We see one in Instagram, one in social media. Everywhere we see photos in different colors, in black and white, and they have different purposes. Some to help us, some to entertain us. But photography was not actually the name you think that was given in the eighteenth century. They didn't know what to call. Photography, or even knew what it was. So, the inventor and some of his fellow members thought of naming it either photo, photo, let it drawing, or or the other etc. names because they didn't know what was even photography. But inventors and some artists agree. That photography, the process how they take photos, should be named as heliography. So let's all be happy and thank the father of photography, Joseph Nisefo, for creating such a marvelous art that is helping us understand a past, a present, and to also help us to give future the information that they don't even know. So let's all thank Joseph Nisefo for creating such a marvelous art. I I appreciate all of you giving two minutes of your time for my speech. Thank you. Hey, I hope you enjoyed our student spotlight presentation. If you are interested to see how Freedom Life can help your child, I encourage you to sign up for the trials today. You won't be disappointed.